What's up everybody? I just want to do a quick video on this pretty decent camera haul I just picked up. I got all of this for a hundred bucks. Um, so there's more than what was pictured, honestly. I was really surprised. I got this Polaroid 95. That was the first instant camera that Polaroid came up with. They're not worth a whole lot, but they're really good looking cameras. This little Kodak GFE 620 from about the 1920s. These I'm having a very hard time finding an exact date on. I thought they were some sort of brownie camera, but they might have been called something else because these both take 116 film. Um, I'll probably end up selling one and keeping this guy here. I've been wanting a decent one for a while. There was a couple Super 8 cameras. This one here is a Casina. Uh, forget what model or if they just called it a Super 8. I honestly don't remember. That one would probably go on eBay. This old Bolex Standard 8. Pretty neat. Um, there's an instruction manual for pack film camera but there's no pack film camera kind of the same deal here this says it's some sort of instamatic case and in it is a different instamatic that's not on the label there like this one's an x90 it still has film in it but the where the little screw goes in the tripod socket is stuck and i don't want to break it so i haven't tried getting it out of the case yet this is a box of stuff I'm definitely keeping. A couple empty uh, Polaroid film packs. I want to rig something up with a battery and just a couple of junk photos so I can test cameras. Uh, there's another one there. Thing full of flash bulbs. It's full of good bulbs. A couple of flash bars that haven't been opened. Um, Kodak disc camera. I collect some of the cheap Kodak Instamatics, like this is a nicer one, but I collect the cheap ones and I've got a disc camera. I'll hang on to that just if no other reason that it's not really worth the time and effort it would take to sell. This was a 126 cartridge that was in a junk, uh, I think it was a Continental 126. This thing is cool. It's a strap for a Kodak instant camera that's still in the little sleeve. I thought that was really neat. Uh, some sort of adapter ring. I don't know what it adapts to or from. I'm going to mess with that. A couple sealed 110 film cartridges. Pretty old Duracell battery. I don't know why they ended up in there. This one's pretty cool. It's a Kodak color burst. I don't know if it's going to be any good or not. I haven't really messed with this stuff yet. I just threw it off to the side. Because I want to clean up and sell what I can first. I can't get this open, but there's a... Ah, oh, it's already open. That's why. I think that structure manual's in there. I'm not sure what else. Color burst 50. There's a 300 also in the lot that... The batteries are all corroded in. Got a Polavision camera. Which all of this stuff needs cleaned up. This box here is all the more or less big money stuff. Um, the case here is for this SX70. I may try and pick up new leather for it, or I may just send her as is. I mean, it's really clean. It's just this one corner. So I may try and fake that a little bit. Um, I'll test that, see if that's any good. There were still cartridges in both Super 8 cameras. So I'm definitely hanging on to those. There's an SLR 680, which definitely needs new leather. Because it's all cracking and peeling apart. Other than that, it looks in good shape. It's still in the box with the instructions, too. I thought that was really cool. So, I gotta see, I might have 
some 600 film somewhere. I honestly don't remember. I know I don't have any SX-70, so I'll have to pick some up. But anyway, little Ansco, cheapo 35 millimeter. Sonar one step that's in the box with the instructions. The box is all tore up. It's there. Old Kodak flash holder. Kodak Brownie. In the box, don't like it don't look like it was hardly used. The batteries are still here, like they're still in the box. I thought that was wild. I'll probably fill it back up with flash bulbs. I'm pretty sure I've got some more of those GE bulbs. So I'll fill it back up and fake it. So that's pretty much the good stuff. This stuff is more or less junk. Some sort of like portable VHF TV empty box. This was that other 126 camera, but the batteries are they exploded in the camera, so it's junk. I've got this some sort of weird Kodak Super 8 I've never seen. It's all grimy, batteries are corroded. Miscellaneous stuff in there, flash that the batteries blew up in. Color Burst 300. I, I'll probably try and clean that up, but it's same deal. Batteries were left in it. That's what I got. I got all of this for 100 bucks. There's a handful of pieces I'm going to keep, uh, mainly this stuff. Um, the SX-70 I'll probably let go of because I'm not going to shoot enough to, to make it worth keeping. I've got a couple 600s. I, I shoot them worth. Then I did my SX-70 sonar. So my plan is to sell that, which should pay for everything, essentially. And then if I get any profit out of that, I'm going to buy the undo leather for the SLR-680. Sell that and make even more. But uh, I've just been messing around cleaning this stuff up. Definitely got my hands full for this weekend. See so if there's any of this you guys have questions on, or if okay, if you're interested on it, in it, it'll be a some of it'll be on eBay. Um, yeah, anything you guys have questions on, want to see more of, whatever. If you want to see more of my collection, just give me a shout. Uh, anyways, I hope you enjoy.